So I have done a skincare routine once before, but I wanted to do an updated one as it has changed a little bit since then. My skin is very dry and sensitive, so these products that I use are kind of tailored toward that. Like for example, if you have oily skin, these products might not be the best for you because for one, like my cleanser is very gentle, my moisturizer is very thick and dense. So just something to think about. So at night, I'll start with washing my face. I like this cleanser from La Roche-Posay. It's fragrance free and has niacinamide in it amongst other things. But in the morning, I don't wash my face in the morning just because I find that my skin is better in the morning. If I touch it too much, then it becomes really red. So I personally just like will splash my face with water in the morning and then I'll put on this. And these are my old breast pads <laughs> from when I nursed in the very beginning. And they're cotton and washable, so I don't really find it weird. And then I will go in with a moisturizer. I have been loving Coco Kind. I really like it. It's extremely thick. So if you don't want like a thick moisturizer, I wouldn't recommend it. I kind of put a little too much, but hey, whatever. <laughs> I forgot to mention, I also have two different serums from Coco Kind that I kind of rotate in the evening. This one is the Vitamin C Serum, this postbiotic acne serum, which it has really helped like get some of my acne scarring down. And I've noticed I don't break out as much around like my period time. And then at night, I also will go in with this eye cream. And then the last thing I do for the morning is SPF. I'll go sometimes like a few days without doing anything if I'm not wearing makeup. If I'm wearing makeup, of course I'll wash it off. If I'm just at home and not planning to put on makeup for the next couple days, sometimes I'll just put on moisturizer or whatever, SPF, and I don't really like actually do much, which I feel like my skin actually likes to have like breaks sometimes. So that is my updated skincare. Again, I like to keep it really simple. I think that just works for me. Now let's get into makeup. Today's video is actually being sponsored by Merit. If you've been around for a little bit, you've heard me talking about Merit before and it's my favorite makeup brand. And then they just launched this new skincare product, which is called Great Skin. And the purpose of this is as like a base for your makeup. And I honestly love this. Like it feels so amazing on the skin. It just feels so hydrating and cooling. The next product from Merit is called The Minimalist, and it's not a foundation or a concealer, but it basically replaces both. I love this. I have been using this for over a year, and I just got this new one in my favorite color, which is Bone, which is like the lightest color you can get because I have very pale skin, I've found. I'm just going to put this on the places that I want some extra coverage. It's not heavy at all. I've never had any issues with it causing me to break out. Next, I'm gonna be using their Flush Balm. And this is like an older model that I bought with my own money. <laughs> uh, now they come with like a gold trim. And this is in the color Cheeky. So I'll just kind of swipe it a few times on the brush. I used to do it with my finger, but I found I really like how it blends with the brush. Then I like to add a little bit on my nose. This next product is their Brow 1980 in the color brown, and they make great Christmas gifts, great stocking stuffers if you're into that. And all of their orders above $40 ship free. Also, if it's your first order with them, they ship with this makeup bag, which is my favorite. I'm obsessed with it. I use it every day. This is where my makeup lives, and it's so cute. <laughs> Next, I'm gonna be using their Clean Brow in the color Perfect Black. So, what are some things that you guys have been up to lately? I have been like getting a lot more into books recently. I go in phases where I'm really into reading and then I'll spend like six months and not read a single book or I'll just read audi listen to audiobooks. But I'm on the kick right now of reading actual books. We had an incident about a week ago where um, Luke was setting up a tripod to film and Zion accidentally knocked it down and it hit our TV. Thankfully he didn't get hurt, but our TV like broke and we were both kind of like, meh, let's just not replace it. Which was honestly kind of nice not having a TV because 
I've been watching a lot less TV. I've been reading instead, which has been bringing me a lot of joy. Right now, I have been reading, um, it's called The Selection. It's like a young adult novel. Anyway, check it out if you haven't. It's really good. I think it's good. I don't know. <sighs> okay, forgot my lipstick. I'm just gonna like dab it on my finger. Put a little bit of chapstick on already. So let me know in the comments if you guys are readers and if you have any book recommendations. Um, I love going to the library because it's free. I'm also listening to the audiobook right now. Um, Charles Dickens, what's it called? <laughs> David Copperfield. It's really good, I like it a lot. It kind of honestly reminds me of like the male version of Jane Eyre. Difficult upbringing, becomes an orphan, goes to school, and that's kind of as far as I've got so far. But yeah, it's a good book. I would recommend it if you like classics. So this is the finished face. Everything from Merit and my skincare. And I, again, I will link everything down below and all of the products for Merit. Um, you can use my affiliate link down below. All of their products are clean and they're anti-acne triggering. Again, I've been using this for over a year and I haven't had any issues with acne caused from this makeup. So I love it. I will be using it for a really, really long time. So thank you Merit for sponsoring this video. Well, thank you guys for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. And let me know in the comments any book recommendations you have, or if you tried any of the things I mentioned today and let me know what you think of them. If you haven't checked out our website, creativeforeden.com, be sure to do so. That is linked down below. We have a lot of things on there for sale. We have some merch and uh, different paintings that I hand painted. And my husband also made some handmade wallets that are amazing. I also have a blog on there and my recent post is a kid's gift guide for 2022. So check that out. If you order some stuff soon, you probably could get it for Christmas. And again, my merit link will be down below if you are interested in purchasing anything from them. Genuinely, they are an amazing company and I love what they create. Thank you so much for your support and for being my friends. I hope you have a lovely rest of your day. Bye.